See, I'm okay with looting these, because these people are trying to kill us. You should explain your whole uh, theory of why we haven't been stealing from people this whole time. Because it's like, uh, in kingdoms, or like in most modern RPGs, if if the treasure's red, then you don't, you, you, uh, aren't, you're stealing, and if it's not red, then you're not. In these games, you can, uh, you can take all of them, because it aid for the adventure. Hey, you found the secret naga at Rumble. Hey everyone, humans. We hate those guys. They're after the bro mine. Bro. bro. <laughs> Get them. And they're all henches. They're not actually henches, they're just hench. Dude, you missed a double technique. You could have totally taken that third guy's out. It was grayed out, I think I used up too much MP. Dang it. Dang it. Does Frog Guy have, Pew! Does Frog guy have any techniques? Mm. He has slip. Oh, yeah. It's like a heal. It's like a really gross heal. I'd be like, Really damaged. I'm like, he's like, I can use my sleep on thou, and I or slip on thou, and I'd be like, oh, no, I'm good, <laughs> I'm good. Nay, fair frog, I shan't be requiring your oral stimulation. <laughs> is that what it really is? Uh, pretty much. You're just like, oh, slurp, oh. Got a maiden suit. Sweet. I love maidens wore dresses. Well, we can, well, it's a maiden suit. That's why they they could have just said dress, but they didn't. It wasn't it's not a dress. It's a suit. It's a suit. <laughs> oh, okay. If they had said maiden's garb, you would have been like, yeah, it's probably a dress. He's got a lot of bronze. Yeah, he starts with a power blow. Anything in these buckets? There ain't in the buckets. I don't think so. There's a lot of books there, though. Monsters, some of those monsters must be pretty smart. Oh dear. Sight as many things you can. Those are some badass graphics. It's 1995 for you right there. Diablos. I think they're going to be able to tell that you're tired by your sheer inability to finish thoughts. No, I just saying Diablos. What's with the disguise? This is monsters in their natural environments. See how I slipped yeah, right I in there? I saw that. It was yeah. very nice. Yeah. I'm really proud of that. Well, see, this is a bit of a conundrum. My gut instincts would say that we should be friends with the monsters, but clearly they can, you know, communicate intelligibly. But at the same time, they're like, we eat people, and that's not cool. Yeah, these ones, these monsters are kind of jerk faces, but that whole, actually that whole, uh, well, conundrum comes up later on in the game. That whole kind of deal of, should we be friends with these mystics? The monsters? Or, you know, should we just exterminate them? Only time will tell. 
Ugh. What's happening, people? I get the feeling that no one here is who they look like they're supposed to be. Well, don't talk to them until you get your treasures. Try to go in that little hallway there. Alright. Sweet. Oh, dearest Megas, your flashing eyes like stars, and flowing hair like waves atop the sea. Why don't you ever project when you're doing these performances? You get all, like, quiet and stuff. Because it's subtle and beautiful. You need to at least speak with some assertiveness. No sad, sunny day, nor any frightful, bright place can get us down. As long as you're me, there's nothing to fear. Megas, so oh Megas, our hero, Megas. We were supposed to do that chorus together. Ah, uh, it was a chorus. <laughs> you didn't prepare me for it. Come on. You could have, like, waved at me or something, or... <laughs> Try to give me something to work with. Yeah, ha ha. Yeah, I'm not working. You need to comb them. If you can, comb them, I would say. I'm working. Sometimes you get three or even four enemies, but not very often. Yeah. Slurp cut? That's like a that's like a rapist move. <laughs> Why would you say something like that? <sighs> You're supposed to be the champions of justice here, and you're like that's a rapist move. It's true though. Look at that beautiful, beautiful statue of Megas. Should I? Should I touch it? I don't know. I'll try to. Nope, nope. Won't let Just me up the podium. Me. Even, even for like, I don't know, that just looks awesome. Even now. Try like walking the wall. I don't think there's anything in here that, I mean, the Defender and the, what you guys got are both really good. Yeah, that's it. You know, everything's more impressive when you can get a shaft of light directed onto it. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much true. I don't know why museums don't, like, do the whole natural sunlight thing more often. They do. Some of them do. Some of them definitely do. It's already fast enough. I thought it was bigger. Oh, I got that speed belt. Oh. That is the speed. Yeah. The, the faster your speed, the better. Until you get, like, uh, what's it? The speed home or whatever it is. Showing the enemies, uh, someone should always have the sight scope. Yeah, so I should keep that on Luca. Yeah, yeah, except for when you, uh, don't have, a, or except for, like, boss battles. Just usually, I don't think you can see their hit points. Oh, you can organize, and it'll organize everything. Into a nice little, easy to get at. You know, just go out, out one time. And, you know, Shazam! You talk to these guys. Okay. No, not at all. Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. Oh, yeah, that makes perfect sense. You notice 
notice how evil people are really happy? I always seem happy in video games, that's for sure. I don't think I've known anyone who's truly evil. Besides you, of course. Right. This is supposed to be the goodness. Don't go telling people I'm evil. <laughs> <laughs> I'm advising you to do the right thing because it will ultimately destroy the world. That's a good plan. It's a very good plan. We're definitely going to have to start playing something that's a little more uh, morality optional so we can start showcasing this stuff better. Well, this game, like Chrono and everyone, are just good. There's no... you don't get to choose to do, like, to be evil and stuff like that. Well, I mean, we've... there have been some options where you could kind of be a dick a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but... I don't know. Sometimes being a dick will actually add to spice the spice of life, as long as you're not like being a real dick. It's, it's, yeah, it's because being a fake dick is perfectly acceptable. Yeah, but being a real one is just well, kind of being a dick. <laughs> it's kind of dickish. This is the philosophy that you came here for, folks. <laughs>